Hello everybody and welcome to a different video for the channel instead of my normal subpar video game videos. Instead I will do something different today and check out this Z Ration Zombie MRE. I'm a big fan of MREs. I Usually order me a couple here and there, and even watch a few videos, or shouldn't excuse me, a few channels that review MREs, and on their channel I kept seeing this Z ration pop up, which looks pretty cool, so I decided, you know, I should probably check this one out. It's by the company allmres.com, which is a good website to get your MREs from. They have some just about any any type you can probably think of on there, MRE wise, and they started making this Z Ration Zombie MRE, so I decided to check it out, and and depending on how this turns out, I might even check out the rest of their menus. The menu I got today is menu O, which is beef taco. So that should be fun. Went with, the reason why I went with the beef taco is I personally haven't had a beef taco MRE before, so decided why not try it with this. So let's get right into it. Whereas some MREs you have to yank apart, this one has a pull tab right here, so. Oops. And I, am, I do apologize for the camera shaking back and forth. The stand I have for my... Because I'm recording this off my phone. It's like this long bendable tube that clips onto my table. And the other end clips onto the phone. Which isn't really the best of the stands. But it was the only stand I could find. So, if you don't like the shaking in this video, you can blame the guy Ron at Walmart who sold me this stand. And that's besides the point. So, let's see what we got in here. We got... Mott's applesauce. Here's our beef taco mix. Here's your nutrition facts for all you health nuts out there. Ooh, chipotle tortillas. All right. Let's dump this bad boy out. Get. Little bottle of Tabasco sauce. Always nice to keep a little bit of Tabasco sauce on hand. Here's our oh, flameless ration heater. Wet nap. Ooh, Propel. Berry flavored. That's good. Sea Ration Zombie Pub Mix. And that's one thing I nice I noticed about these Z Rations is they do have their own snacks and stuff like that in the thing besides our the normal that you'd see in a regular MRE. Jalapeno cheese spread. I'm thankful I got the cheese spread. Because not in the Z Rations. But when I was watching some MRE reviews of the beef taco, the guys I watched got peanut butter and jelly. So, they had to, you know, just eat the uh, beef taco mix 
off their tray and make a peanut butter and jelly tortilla sandwich. So luckily, we got some cheese spread. Next up is an apple turnover. All right. Let's go ahead. And uh, get this stuff onto a tray. Okay. I uh, know I didn't open this a second ago, but just because all it was, I know there'll be some people out there complaining I didn't open the little accessory pack thing, even though this isn't your average accessory pack, it's just knife, fork, and spoon, napkin, and some salt and pepper. Pepper off the side, save the salt for something here in a second. And let's go ahead and get our beef taco cooking. I want to bump the camera. Personally, I've always had issues with these flameless rationators. Oh, yep, see. Come on. Oh, let's try it. Let's try and pour this up to the fill line. Stop making a mess here. Got it up to the filling, and one thing I was going to do, which I unfortunately forgot, was one trick I saw to get these flameless ration heaters heated up a lot quickly is add some salt to it. Ooh, and I can already feel this one's heating up in my hand. So we gotta make this thing quick, because this is actually a good one. So I had plenty of ration heaters, personally, that just took forever to heat. Even had one day, a couple weeks ago I bought a MRE, I think it was a maple breakfast sausage, and my ration heater got hot, but the meal was still kind of cold. So let's just turn it this way, get all this water going. Probably should have added the salt first. Oops. Yep, I have lift off. So, get our beef taco mix. And what the hell, we'll put our tortillas in there. Okay, set this bad boy off to the side so it can do its thing.
Okay, let's check out the rest of our goodies. Let's go ahead and get our Propel drink mix ready. I'm surprised they didn't get like an instant coffee or something in this one. I haven't seen a in Marine in a while that didn't come with a in some sort of instant coffee or tea. That's good. Next, let's check out our, check out this zombie pub mix. Just like Chex Mix. Hmm. Oh, fuck it. It's nice that that even had a Ziploc bag, so if you're out in the field or something. Your beef, you eat your beef taco and save that for a snack later on throughout the day. Let's got some pretzels. Sesame sticks. Not bad. Check out this applesauce. I know these are made in packages where you could drink it, but for the purpose of this video, and there's our apple turnover. Ooh. Just opening the bag, the smell of the apples and the cinnamon just hit me right in the face. This smells good. Yeah, this smells real good. Yeah, that smelled real good. All right, let's check out this oatmeal. No, oh. applesauce. Sorry. Don't know why I was thinking about oatmeal. Pretty good, this, your standard applesauce. It's the, Mott's brand applesauce, so up, up to the normal quality of their applesauce, which isn't too bad. Pretty good. Now let's try this bad boy. I can still smell this guy. The apple turnover. I don't know if you can see, it even does have chunks of apple inside of it. Mm. 
Very good. Wow. Definitely has a lot of cinnamon in it. It's not like overpoweringly bad. But I can definitely tell it's there. Let's take a piece of this. Oh, yeah. Tip it in our applesauce. Beef taco mix would be... About done. Uh, let's go ahead and break this guy up. Here's our Chipotle tortillas. Let me scoop this guy up just a little bit. Definitely smell the chipotle. Probably should have heated these guys just a bit more, but not too bad. Yeah, you can smell the chipotle in these guys. They're definitely not kidding around. Got chipotle tortillas. Excuse me. And jalapeno cheese spread. My ass is going to be sore tonight. Check out this beef taco mix. Still feels a little cold inside, so let's just get this mixed together. Come on, slippery. Kind of like chili. We see the uh, chunks of beef. Let's get a little bit and give it just, just a try. Actually, let's pour it out here on the tray first. This definitely looks like some beef chili, but I can smell like the taco flavoring in it. You know, pepper was just sitting there. Didn't want it to go away, so fuck it. Turn around. Here we go. Definitely tastes like taco meat. Yeah, definitely tastes like, uh, it's taco meat, there is like a bit of spice to it, like, I 
like the like kind of like a hot spice to it like I can feel in the back of my throat not bad probably could have let it heat up just a little longer but we'll be fine this guy off to the side sorry for bumping the camera jalapeno cheese spread Oops. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's get one of our tortillas. And then a bit of this jalapeno cheese, which kind of looks kind of scary, but we'll be fine. Oops. Here it is, wrapped in the uh, chipotle tortilla with jalapeno cheese. Definitely not bad. The uh, jalapeno, uh, jalapeno, the chipotle tortilla tasted better than I thought it would. And the uh, jalapeno cheese wasn't as spicy as I thought it was going to be. I know I just had this suspicion it was going to be pretty spicy, but you can definitely taste the jalapeno in it. But all in all, this isn't a uh, bad MRE. I definitely. I definitely want to check out the rest of the uh, Z Ration line of MREs. Which there's a lot of them. Even a uh, 24 hour first strike ration, which would be pretty cool. So, yeah, thanks for checking the video out. And feel free to subscribe and like the video. Thank you.